Okay, I'm going to punch a uh, 220 uh, repeater into the Valfang UV-9S. And I'm going to do it rather fast, so try to follow along with me here. So, turn it on. Channel mode. We're in channel mode. I'm going into the VFO, which is here. Frequency mode. Frequency mode. I'm going to punch in a 220 repeater with the split, the PL, the offset, and the shift. I'm going to put it into a memory channel. Okay, so the repeater here is 224.36. So all you do, I have the arrow down here on the bottom. 224. 224. Okay, the first thing I want to do now is get into the menu, and I'm going to go to menu number 13. I'm just going to hit menu and punch in 13. I was told I used the up and down keys too much, which I actually like to do, but I'm just going to hit menu and push number 13 to bring me to the PL. So menu. Menu. Number 13. And the offset is, I want to go up. Uh, I want to hit menu again, sorry, on number 13. CTCS. Bring the arrow down. I want to go up to a PL of 141. Confirm it by hitting menu again. Confirm. I'm going to go to memory number 26. And here's the offset. It's 001.60, so just punch in. It's in there already, but... Welch. Confirm. Memory number 26. Welch. Confirm. Offset frequency. I'm going to bring the arrow down, confusing myself. Zero. Zero. One. Six. Zero. Zero. Confirm. Now I want to go to number 25. Hit the menu button to bring the arrow down. Frequency direction. Hit the arrow. I want a minus. Hit the menu to confirm it. Confirm. Uh, let's see what we got here. Okay, so now I want to put this repeater in uh, menu uh, memory channel number 30. So, I want to hit the menu and press number 27 to bring me into menu number 27. Menu. Hit the menu button. Memory channel. And scroll up. I like using these up and down keys, you know, I can't help it. Number 30 should be blank. Okay, it's blank, so hit the menu button to confirm it. Receiving them. Hit the push to talk. Channel mode. Hit the channel mode, and the repeater is in memory number 30. Push to talk to make sure it works. Okay, I want to show you a couple little features that this radio has here. I got a very long antenna on this thing, very long. It's a rat tail. <laughs> it's a tri-band antenna that came off. Uh, these radios come with two separate antennas, but this one came with three. So, anyway, this is a tri-band antenna. It comes with a 2 meter 440 antenna, and it comes with a 220 antenna, which I'm not too, really too fond about. I'd rather have all three bands so with this thing, anyway. So, anyway, it's got a few little features here on the side here. It gives you FM radio. So, I mean, you play around a little bit. I don't have anything put in there, but uh, it also gives you uh, on the on the bottom button here. If you hit it, it gives you a, a flashlight. If you hit it again, it gives you a blinking light. If you hit it again, it stops. If you hold in this button, that gives you the radio, 
it gives you a siren in case you fell down a mountain somewhere and you're out in the middle of nowhere. You can hold this thing and maybe somebody will hear it. You can lower it by the volume. <laughs> but I'll hold it in, right? There you go. You can turn it up. So it gets pretty loud. So anyway, that's it. The UV-9S, and there you have it.